Another magical way to while away a few Central Park hours is on a gondola. And if you do, make sure you ask for Andreas. So I've been a gondolier in Central Park for 25 years. Wow. And boy, are my arms tired. That's a quarter century. That's huge. I thought I would do it for, you know, a couple of years, you know, a couple summers, a nice summer gig. And I'll be honest with you, I fell in love with this job. And what do you love about it? You know, there's so much that I love about it. I don't, really don't know where to start. Try. Uh, <laughs> you know, first of all, I'm in Central Park. All this beautiful greenery. You know, most people live in this concrete jungle and don't experience this, just, you know, maybe every now and again. Every single person that comes on this gondola is happy. So I row around happy people all day. And that's, that's the best part of this job. What do you love about Central Park the most? This was farmland. Central Park took 30 years to build. 1850, they started to build Central Park. All these lakes are dredged. All the hills are man-made. The city planners to build this giant park in the middle of this uh, concrete jungle, I love that. I think that's, that's just hu humanity at its greatest. Now, last time I was in Venice, I did have the, the great fortune to go on a gondola. Right. And the, the lovely gentleman who was rowing for me sang to me. No, he didn't. Yes, he did. Wow. Do you think that you could do the same? Well, that's just because you're so beautiful. Oh, come on. Let me tell you, those gondoliers are few and far between that sing nowadays. Uh-huh. Are you one of those guys? Oh, yeah, I sing. Andreas, let it felt one out for me. Vido cuore quante bello. Spira tanto sentimento, come tu vo suova cento, che mi desto fa sognar. 